Well, it is her favourite time of the year. Lisa Fernandez is at the Perth Royal Show all this week. Lisa, good morning to you. You look like you might have stumbled onto the set of The Farmer Wants a Wife there. Well, it's funny you should say that because it's actually Shearer Wants a Wife this morning and <laughs> I think I'm going to move to the farm because that's the sort of life I deserve to have. Love a lamb your kids can do today at the Perth Royal Show, which is absolutely fantastic. They get to feed the lambs, but come around here. I've got two, two lovely young fellas uh, up on the stage ready to do some sheep shearing for, the, for me this morning. We're going to find out how to do uh, a sheep the old way and the new way and they'll be doing that probably in about five minutes time and it is Shearer What's a Wife this morning. Both of them upstanding young... F Are either of you married? He was and... <laughs> Depends whether his wife's watching. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay, I'll be back shortly from here I'll at the ITA with you, Lisa. Royal Show. Certainly. Bye bye. Good luck with that. Right, let's go back to Lisa Fernandez now. At the Royal Show, she's got the shears out this morning, Lisa. Can you believe that I'm not going to be shearing a sheep? Uh, look, that was I'm so here. So bad. <laughs> Even I wouldn't I do mean, that one. That I, was I'm terrible. Here with Todd, who's competing in the Trans Tasman Western Australia Shearing Championships. Todd, what's your sheep's name? Uh, this one's a little bit of a cutie, so I'm going to call her Jill. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I've also got Kevin. Hi, now, Lisa. Kevin, hello, good morning. Kevin's been coming to the Rule Show for uh, IJ Rule Show for 25 years now. This is the way sheep is sheared today. This Talk right. us through it. Right, Todd's going to do the most difficult part of the moment. The yeah. neck is really difficult. He's going to go up there blind. Yeah. And he's going to open this wall right up here. Oh, Beautifully wow. done, Todd, as he goes around here. He'll always grab the ear out of the way so yeah. he doesn't make any nicks or mistakes. Okay. He's just an outstanding shearer. Yeah. He's uh, going to New Zealand for Trans Tasman. Yes. He's just about to go down onto the long blow. We call this the long blow. Yes. And he's doing a magnificent job oh. there as he sweeps down onto the long blow. Wow. It's like poetry in motion, ladies I, and gentlemen. I'm sorry, Kevin, are you actually a commentator for sheep shearing? I am, yeah. Brilliant. I do. I'm quite is a bit of commentating. How too. good is that? So I commentate. And he's yeah. just doing a fantastic job yep. as he comes off the long blow now. He's yep. just about to go onto the, long, onto the last side, which yep. is... The okay. old days are called the whipping side. The whipping side. Okay, I'm loving what he's doing, but I want to get to the old days, which is just um, Courtney, Courtney over yeah. on our left-hand side. Can we'll go over there? Yeah, okay, well, we can. Yeah, Gerard can take the camera over there, and you can just talk us through it. So Radio. talk us... Radio. so we've got uh, Courtney going over. It's the old-fashioned way of shearing from the turn of wow. the last century. You know, we use blades, and most of us here, sheep were shorn, or all the sheep were shorn yep. with the blade. With the blades, and uh, Courtney's actually leaving a filament of uh, fibre on Now, here. why is he leaving a bit of wool on? Well, because of... Uh, can I just reach in, Courtney? Can I just quickly just show just yeah, what we were doing? Because yeah. Courtney's left him quite a bit of wool on here, and why have he done that? Well, why he's doing that is because she's going to go to waging, and he wants yep. to leave 25 mil on it, yep. so it matches up with the sheep that are already, you know, been shorn yes. three to four months ago. So wow. this is a really hard thing to do to leave... You know, so much wool on that. So much wool on, yeah. And I'm going to so just keep it on Courtney for a moment. Courtney's no, been shearing for many, many years. Obviously, all these guys oh, he, have. He's the one of the best in the world at blade shearing and oh, doing wow. this type of shearing. So okay. he's doing an outstanding job. Kev, I just need to read the weather. We reached a live 12 degrees this morning. In Perth today, we're heading for a partly cloudy day uh, with a top of 22. Perth tomorrow, mostly sunny, 24. I will say it's beautiful to come to the IJ Perth Royal Show today because it's not too hot. Over the next few days, Thursday, sunny and 30. Friday, partly cloudy, 26 degrees. Saturday possible morning shower 24 and Sunday and Monday uh, look shower or two Monday and mostly sunny 22. I'll be back with more from the IJ Perth Royal Show. How's Jilly going? Yeah, she's yeah good. Done. She's done. Have a look at that. And Courtney and Todd and Kevin, thank you so much, thank gentlemen, for letting much. me here and to see what fantastic work they do. Um, Shira wants a wife coming to Channel <laughs> 9 very soon. At least do they get the mirror out at the end at least and show the sheep the back? Do they get the mirror? No, know, they don't show the, the sheep the thing, no. Because, you know, it might be like, oh, does my bum look big now? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what sheep do. You always ask me these questions and stuff comes out of my mouth that I can't stop. <laughs> it's just another day then. Thank you, Lise. It still is. Bye.